White House Press Secretary Corinne Jean-Pierre congratulated all the Swifties out there after the Kansas City Chiefs Super Bowl win but she couldn't say if Taylor Swift would join boyfriend Travis Kelsey when the team gets honored by President Joe Biden. The president was able to catch some of the game and, on his behalf, I want to extend a big congratulations to the Kansas City Chiefs on their third Super Bowl win in just five seasons. And also congratulations to all the Swifties out there, she said Monday at her daily press briefing, the White House announced it will host the Super Bowl champion Kansas City Chiefs again, and hasn't ruled out the possibility of Taylor Swift tag along this time. During Monday's press conference, when asked if the pop star, who is dating Chiefs Travis Kelsey, could come to celebrate as a plus one, press secretary Corinne Jean-Pierre replied, it will be up to the Chiefs, and obviously it is up to them to figure out who will go with them, she added, I can't speak to the attendees and who will be here, when asked further about whether players would be allowed to bring guests. Jean-Pierre said she was unsure about the process, that's a good question. I can't answer it right now. But, look, we look forward to seeing them here, the Chiefs, she said, Taylor Swift's political views, former President Donald Trump, the frontrunner in the Republican presidential primary, posted online before the Super Bowl that, if Swift endorsed Biden, it would be disloyal to the man who make her a lot of money. Trump continued that he was responsible for the Music Modernization Act, which Congress passed in 2018 with strong bipartisan support. Swift previously endorsed Joe Biden for the 2020 presidential race, but has so far remained neutral in the 2024 election season. Swift largely avoided questions about her personal beliefs about politics until 2018, when Swift showed support for Democrats. In the past I've been reluctant to publicly voice my political opinions, but due to several events in my life and in the world in the past two years, I feel very differently about that now, Swift wrote in a post on Instagram in October 2018. In that post, Swift wrote that the voting record for the Republican candidate for Senate in Tennessee, Marsha Blackburn, appalls and terrifies me. Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey's love story Swift began dating Kelsey after he invited her to a game. Earlier in the season, and she has been a frequent attendee at Chiefs games ever since. Kelsey and Swift have tried to keep their relationship out of the spotlight, though it has become increasingly difficult. Well, you know the goal has always been to get three, Kelsey screamed on stage after winning the big game and sharing a kiss with Swift. But we couldn't get here without getting that two, and having that target on our back all year. How about that? We get a chance to do it three times in a row, many wondered if time would be on the singer's side, given that her Tokyo concert and the Super Bowl were close together, and just days after the Grammy Awards, but, without any delays, Swift made the flight to the US and arrived at Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas the day before the big game. With Swift watching Kelsey from a suite all season, the Chiefs are now among the league's greatest and most popular franchises.